Good morning, and now uh, the few and far between people that actually watch my videos. Um, uh, I was just uh, reading my Bleacher Report, and I heard that uh, George St. Pierre says that um, Henderson versus Shogun wasn't impressive. He was not impressed with his performance. Um, I mean, that, that has douchebag of the year written all over it. How could you not say that that was an epic fight? Uh, he, I mean, that's not what he said. What he said was um, the guys were too tired uh, to determine um, whether they could, you know, that they they, they, they lack technique and, and they lack this, they lack that. And, uh, me personally, I don't think they lacked anything. I think they, they, I think they brought it. I think they brought it all, and I think that's candidate for fight of the year. My vote for fight of the year would be uh, Diaz Penn. Um, originally slated to be um, co-main event, but later on, um, DSP uh, got hurt, and um, yeah, so Diaz and uh, Penn got pumped uh, to the main event, and uh, we all know what happened after that. So, um, uh, I'm a huge, huge, huge DS fan, Nate and Nick. So, um, uh, what do you think about George St. Pierre and, and his, like, recent, uh, cocky comments? Do you think Nick's got into his head? Do you, do you think that, uh, Nick Diaz seriously has gotten into George St. Pierre's head? Do you think that maybe, um, maybe he's a little, um, I don't know. I don't want to say scared, uh, but uh, but I definitely want to say um, um, timid. You know, a little timid going into this fight or training for this fight. Uh, he said that uh, Greg Jackson will be training with him, but uh, Greg will be going uh, up to Montreal as opposed to him going to Albuquerque. So um, I mean, that's huge, man. You know, you get Greg Jackson to fucking travel wherever the hell you are. That's huge. Um, but him saying that Hendo versus Hua was not a good fight. He didn't say it, was, it wasn't a good fight. Now I'm taking words out of his mouth and it's right on my own. But uh, but, but he, he, he honestly did say that he didn't feel that it was a good fight. He thought that it was, um, it was more uh, heart determination and will than uh, technique or, or any sort of, you know, good fight. You know, like a good mixed martial arts battle. I disagree. I think it was a perfect, a perfect setup, and I would love to see uh, Hua Henderson too. Who wouldn't? Would you? If you do, uh, comment below, like the video. Um, good morning to all, and I'm glad you're watching my videos, and um, and I love you all very much, very, uh, very much, and um, uh, believe me, I'm. Uh, I will see your comments, and uh, I will look at your channels, and um, and uh, uh, hopefully I'll get some likes going on, and um, yeah, I'll see you on the flip side. So, um, what do you think? GSP, he's running his mouth. D did Nick Diaz get into his head? Is Nick Diaz the guy to make GSP all of a sudden the poster boy to the... Uh, the um, the shit talker, I'll say it. Shit talker, yeah. So he's shit talking. I mean, I mean um, uh, I'll try as best I can. Uh, I'm new at this, semi new at this. I mean, I'm, I'm pretty good at computers, but I'll try and um and get the link down there where uh, it's on BleacherReport.com. Uh, uh, GSP doesn't think that Hendo versus Hua was that much of a fight, so. Um, I'll try my best to uh, get that hooked up for you guys, and um, I'll see you on the flip side.